Good morning. All right, guys. Today's a big day for our sweet little babies. It is day 15. So let's count up to 21 because that's how many days it takes for them to hatch. So how many more days is it until hatching day? Start at 15 and count on. Get your fingers ready. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. We're only six days out from their birthday. It's so exciting. And today is really exciting day because we have our first Makers Challenge. And today is Designing Day. So we need to really focus on this word. And the word is coop. Say it, coop. Coop. Coop, 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 coop. Right? Have you ever heard the word coop before? Maybe. Well, I have some news for you. You're going to be really familiar with this word by the end of the week. Okay? Now, before we even go into the whole coop thing, I want us to watch something together. I found on Epic a really quick little thing about what it means to be a chicken. Here it is. Well, hello there. I'm a chicken and I live in a farmyard. Now, where did I leave that egg? Oh, hello, chick. I'm looking for an egg. Have you seen one anywhere? Come on, chick. Maybe it's over here. This is the chicken coop. This is where we go to sleep at night. Oh, hello, rooster. He makes a lot of noise to wake us up in the morning. It's okay, rooster. We're awake now. Now, let me tell you some more about us. We're birds, but we can't fly. Some can fly. We eat lots of different kinds of food. We eat insects, worms, slugs, and lots of other tasty things like seeds and grains and fruit. And lots of creatures like to eat us. We don't like foxes. Chickens lay eggs. Baby chickens hatch out of eggs. But first, I have to sit on the egg and keep it warm. This is called roasting. But where did I leave that egg? Ah, there it is. Come on, chick. So that was some truth. There were some real facts to that one. But I think it would also be a good idea to go ahead and listen to a fiction story that has the word coop in the title. So the title of this book is Big Chickens Fly the Coop. There it is again. Learn as much as you can about a coop. Big chickens fly the coop. Four big chickens sat on their nest inside. It's nice and safe at home in the coop, said one chicken. Yes, said the others. We should always stay home. We could always stay home. We would always stay home. Except we always wanted to see the farmhouse. That's true, said the chicken. And they climbed out of their nest and headed out of the coop. Partway across the farmyard, the chicken stopped. Is that a farmhouse? asked one chicken. It has a roof. They tiptoed closer. It has a door. They stuck their necks out. It has a tail. It's a doghouse! 
the chickens flout, trounced and body bounced, the dogs pounced, drooling muzzles dribbled, frightened yard birds quibbled, sharp teeth crashed, pointed beaks smashed, snap, snap, wings flapped, until four slobbery chickens ran all the way back to the coop. We should have stayed home. We could have stayed home. We would have stayed home. Except we want to taste the bugs at the farmhouse. That's true, said the chickens, and they headed out of the coop. Partway across the farmyard, the chickens stopped. Is that a farmhouse? asked one chicken. It has a chimney. They tiptoed closer. It has a seat. They stuck their necks out. It has four tires. It's a tractor. The chickens scritched, pitched, and flip switched. The tractor twitched into life. The rusty engine roared. Startled heartbeats snored. Black smoke spewed. Foul moods brewed. Eyes burned. Guts churned. Until four sooty chickens ran all the way back to the coop. We should have stayed home. We could have stayed home. We would have stayed home. Except. We want to see the view of the from the farmhouse. That's true, said the chickens, and they headed out of the coop. Way across the farmyard, they stopped. Is that a farmhouse? Asked one chicken. It has a gate. They tiptoed closer. It has a window. They stuck their necks out. It has hay. The chickens stomped, whomped, and clumpity clomped. The horses chomped at the bit. Skittish ponies bolted. Frazzled feathers molted. Hard shoes kicked. Wing tips flipped. Mood whipped. Tails flipped. And tails. Four saddle sore chickens ran all the way back to the coop. The chickens sat on their necks and sighed. We'll never get to the farmhouse, said one chicken. No, said the others. The dogs are too loud. The tractor's too dirty. The horses are too wild. The chicken sighed again. It's too hard. Except chickens can be loud. Chickens can be dirty. Chickens can be wild. That's true, said the chickens. And we really want to see the farm come. Four big chickens climbed out of their nest and headed out of the coop. When the dog barked, the chickens fluttered over the fence and landed on the tractor. When the tractor smoked, the chickens walked off and landed on the horse's back. When the horse but the chickens flipped off and landed in front of a house. Is that the farmhouse? Asked one chicken. It has a roof. It has a door. It has a chimney. It has a seat. It has a window. It has a gate. It must be the farmhouse. The chickens bugged. Slugged and bear hugged. They viewed, shooed, and whooed. Stayed, played, and egg laid. All day long, the chickens glanced, pranced, and tap danced until they noticed their own coop right next door. The end. Got a better idea? What did you notice about that story and about the other one?
the one that was just the quick little intro about a chicken. I know what I noticed about the word coop, and it's that it is where the chickens go to feel safe and secure. It's where um, the predators can't get to them. It's where they can roost. They might have nesting boxes in there, food and water. It would essentially be like us in our own little houses. It's their home. So a coop is a home for chickens, roosters and hens alike, and baby chicks. So you ready for this? I'm super excited. It's time for your first maker challenge you fearless learners you i want to know can you build a mini coop for your peep hmm? can you in the mail you received a bunch of things from us and you have two options if you would like there was a little chick in there that was in the form of an eraser that can be your chick so when you're thinking about like a coop or a home, a house, for that chicken, that chick, it wouldn't be big, like my coops out here, right? Um, it would be something that you could create mm, within like the size of my head, right? Um, and remember, when it comes to these maker challenges, you do not need to be bugging mama and daddy, or grandma and grandpa, or bubby or sissy and saying, we gotta go to the store, we gotta go buy stuff. Mm -mm. Actually, that's against the rules. You're not allowed to do that. You can only make these things from the stuff you have hanging around the house that mommy and daddy say that you are allowed to use. Okay? So, um, you have a list. And here we go. I'm only going to give you these things to go with. Remember, a chicken coop has all of these things. You need to be sure to keep it in mind, okay? And I'll make sure this slide is here. So these are examples. So let's say you have toothpicks or popsicle sticks or straws. Maybe you could build the outside if you don't have an old chew box or something like that, okay? So the outside would be a structure that would keep them safe, that predators can't get into, all right? Because like they said in that one video, lots of things like to eat chickens, all right? And then if you went in the inside, this one is really fancy, fancy. Mine are not this fancy. However, these are what would be the nesting boxes. So that's where the hens might go to lay their eggs or even to roost if they're going to keep their babies warm. Okay. And then up here, you can see where this person put that little ramp to come up so the chickens could go up there because they like to get up on things. Up there is what this stuff is as well. Okay, that's like they like to get up and sit on things. They also might have a run right outside. And a run doesn't mean like, um, run, chicken, run. It's a place where the chickens can go. Um, not all coops have them because some chickens are free range. Like my chickens don't have a run. But let's say if you live in a neighborhood and you can't have your chickens running around, it's almost like a play yard, a, an area that would keep them safe but in. Some people like to have a triangle. That's innovative, isn't it? Because then, see these handles? They can pick it up and move it to another spot in the yard because the chickens will scratch up all kinds of stuff. Um, here's an, a cool idea. I think those are just little Tupperwares that somebody used for their, for their babies to roost. That's just an old jug. Maybe you have a water bottle you can turn upside down and you can poke holes in. I don't know. That looks like a cool way for them to get food. It's like they poke their head in the hole, maybe a bottle cap. Mm -hmm. Just make sure these things, they need to have somewhere for the chickens to roost. They need to have nesting boxes because that's where they lay their eggs. They need to have food and water. Can you hear my puppies going crazy? They need to be sure to have insulation and bedding. That means like um, some kind of hay or straw or even if you just took paper and shredded it up. Um, they like to make sure that ventilation just means that they can breathe. Make sure it's not so airtight that they can't get any air inside there. All right? Um, place for um, shade. Oh, my stars. The chickens do not like to be out. But if you're making a coop, they're going to be shaded anyways. All right? And then the part I love most is the decoration. So make sure you'll be able to get to those eggs when they start laying them. They don't start laying them until they're about six months old. So you have your little eraser, okay? 
So you have a challenge. Now, today is the day you're not really making it. Today's the day where you get all your supplies together and you're going to, in your journal, I would like for you, please, to draw your design. So think on it. Look at all the junk you have, the stuff you have laying around. That puppy is really going crazy. I'll be right back. I'm back. Remember the sun up till sundown? This little guy. Hello. Actually, this little. Oh, this is the one boy. This little guy. He's just a little black lab and he's just whiny, whiny. I'm going to hold him for just a second so I can finish. Where was I? I need y'all. You know, I do this all the time. I need you to help me remember. Um, oh, just collect it all. Come up with a plan. And in your journal, draw a picture of what you think you're going to be able to build. But make sure you sound it out and underneath it, list the materials, okay? And all I want you to do is take a picture of that and upload it to your Seesaw account so that we can see it. Cannot wait to see your ideas. I love crazy ideas. Crazy ideas are my favorite. Just make sure that it's something that you can put together because tomorrow you're going to actually build it. Okay? All right. Make those awesome coops for your babies. The little ones. Love you. Bye.